Uh, twig, twig, <laughs> you uh, you all right down there? <laughs> oh, okay. Eh. <laughs> you were uh out for a couple minutes there. Oh, uh, jeez. Feeling all right? Yeah, yeah, I feel pretty good actually. My head's a lot less foggy feeling, if that makes any sense. There's not anything outside now, is there? We got them all already, huh? Yeah, I think so. Cool! I was thinking, actually, that I th might just go ahead and clean the place up for now. So if you wanted to head back, then you could go ahead. I think I'll, I'll be good over here for now. Well, just give me a holler if you need some help. Will do. Thanks for the help with everything. Not a problem. Take care. See you later, Hawk! to another episode of Clustercraft, it's your pal Twig, and today I am here back in my home village, um, after last episode, or yesterday, where I came over here with Hawk, and we cleared out all of the, um, zombies, dealt with the problems that were over here, you know, and, uh, I figure I actually really like being back home, so I'm going to try and clean the place up and I might even just stay here. It's not super far away from the shanty town where the family is either, so I can just sort of hang out over here if I feel like it, and I won't be too far away for anyone to get to me, which is pretty nice. I think I'll start with my house, or my family's house, and I'll go in there and I'll fix the support beam and maybe clean up a little bit. But I don't know if I want to stay in here, or like, sleeping and stuff. It feels kind of weird staying in a place where my whole family used to be and they're not here anymore. So, I definitely want to fix it, but I don't think I'll be remaining here for sleeping. I'll, I'll have it here for something else. Maybe I'll use it for storage? I don't know. But, either way, I'll have this here, but it won't be where I'm living, living in the village. So I'm gonna start off with this, actually. It is quite the mess. Gotta get this stuff off the floor, first of all, of course. Hmm. I wonder what made it fall. Maybe there was a earthquake or something over here? I'll make this look a little bit more presentable, a little bit more walkable. At least the ceiling didn't come in. It's a little bit of a mess, but it's not a total disaster. Hmm. <clears throat> the floor's kind of jacked up, too. Get this over here, start placing... It's been so long, I don't remember what the floor is actually supposed to be like, so... Well, first of all, I'm gonna go around fixing all the floor now that I've got that big beam out of the way. Fix this all up. Make sure everything's, you know, not broken and sunken and about to collapse underneath our feet. Cause that's less than ideal. If I if I have any luck, then I should be able to make this look at least close to what it used to be before things happened. Like that. Yeah! If that's not what it used to be, then eh, I think it's nicer now. Oh, uh, it came in where my mom's where mom's bed used to be. It came in and like crushed your bed. That's not good. There's this pole that I put up last year to try and keep this from falling down. Mmm. It looks like it didn't really do anything though. Might as well just re-put in this beam too. Should I get different wood? Maybe. It is older wood. I think I'll put some of this in here so I can actually carry things. Before I take everything down, I might as well go actually get the wood I'm gonna replace it with, so. Whee! Hello, Mr. Oak Tree. I am here for your wood. Alright. I'm back over here with some fresher wood. We should be able to get some decent supports back in here. And these middle ones seem to be doing fine enough. I might want to clean up the ceiling a little bit more, though.
Alright. That looks a little better. And this is a mess. That looks nicer. Let's see. Gotta fix this over here now. Bunch of stuff fell in on the couch. Which is super fun. Found some secret wood. That's interesting. I think I might as well redo this whole ceiling, honestly. Such a mess. This one doesn't even have a support. This is already looking a lot better. I gotta get like a replacement bed for over here. Oh wait, I have a white one. Uh, just in case, um, you know. Maybe, maybe mom will be okay. On the slim chance. I gotta get another cake and I'll be back. I'll probably do the rose next. Alright, so I spent some time clearing out the rose from all of the leaves and vines and bushes being overgrown and stuff. And now you can actually, like, walk through the streets over here. It's crazy! Because before we had to, like, jump over all of the, all the leafy bits. And now you can just kind of walk and it's pretty epic. Also, do you see that tree? I, uh, sort of bit, made a big hole in it. So now I'm gonna be setting up my house in here. I've had a little bit of an opening already and I decided to carry it all the way up to the top. So I'm going to be decorating it now and setting up shop and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this my house. I'm gonna set up over here and actually live in the giant tree. Because, I mean, when life gives you lemons, you live in a tree. So, that's the plan. Alright, so, I got the staircase over here built. It goes all the way to the top. There's a couple of floors. This one I think will be like a... It's not really the attic, but it'll act kind of like how an attic is. You know, it doesn't have very much room for stuff, but it's used for storage. Up here, there's another room. I don't know what this one's gonna be. Maybe like a little library area. I might put the enchantment table here. I don't know. And then up here is my bedroom. And I'm going to have my bed. The enchantment table might actually go here, I don't know, it depends on what I feel like putting here. Then up here, there's a nice view of everything because we're on the tree. You just come over here and looks you down. See that little fire pit area, all the houses, the roads. I got some stuff to decorate with now, so I'm gonna head down, grab all that out of those barrels and chests that I put. Kind of make the place look extra pretty. I don't really know what I want to be down here, so I'll go upstairs and do my room first. Uh, trying to think if I want my bed to stay there or not. So I actually have more space over here than I initially planned for. So, gotta rethink how I have this set up for a second. So, what if we put bed? Gotta figure out where this is going. I think here. We put the bookie there. Yeah, I like this corner. The nice corner. This. Yeah. I uh, just gotta find one that, like... Yeah, puppies! Or at least I think it looks like puppies. I really don't know. If you move back and you and you and you squint, that's puppies. You got a funky little corner with some storage and stuff. And then over here, for the enchantment table situation, if I remember right, do an enchantment table in the middle. There's like one block and then five by five around it of the books. I don't have enough bookshelves to even do it. You know, like so many bookshelves. I'd do like a little study instead. Yeah, 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 and I think I'll put that there. Yeah, and this side could be like where, uh, where, uh, where, uh, where, uh, little study area is. Put that there, and then go. I'll get another to put there. I just need a lot more bookshelves, is what I'm seeing. Yeah, I'm gonna go get some bookshelves. Cause I need bookshelves. <laughs> Alright, I just got back. I have my bookshelves again and I can go back to uh, decorating my funky little house. And it's gonna be, it's gonna be great. I'm very excited to be living in the village again, really. It's nice out here. And uh, you know, it's my home so it reminds me of home. He could have swore I saw something over. showed up.
up that one night at the bar. Uh, I don't, I don't need that. Thank you. Um, what, what do you want? What's up? Uh, I, I think I called you Richard, right? Yeah. Uh, you are weirdly familiar. And I don't mean in the sense that I just met you at the, at the, at the bar that one. Hello? What? What are, what are you? That is so weird. That is so weird. Okay, where is he now? Where is he now? Whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Stay still for a second. You don't... You don't feel right. I don't... I don't know what it is, but... Um... I am increasingly uncomfortable with this current situation. Ah, um... What, what, are you, what are you visiting for, uh, buddy? Do you... Do you want something? Do you want... Do you want bread? I got bread. I can... I can give you food. Is that... Uh, no, I don't want any of that, thank you! <laughs> hawk! Hawk! Jerk, I miss help! There's a thing, there's a thing! Hi guys, Twig's having a little bit of a moment, so I figured I'd come and, uh, do the outro, because they're, um... Having a bit of a moment, as I previously stated. Thanks for watching the video. Make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you enjoy seeing the content that I put in front of your eyeballs. And before I let you go, I'm just gonna give you the friendly reminder that you're amazing, you're beautiful, and you're loved. Have a wonderful day, guys.